The best thing about PC is that you can build it by yourself and building your own PC is the most satisfying thing in the world, at least for me. And I have said this in a bunch of time in my videos. And for some good reasons, honestly, you can build your own PC, you can curate your hardware around your budget and your needs and also you can customize your PC's looks by your liking. But when it comes to laptop, you really don't have that option. You have to stick with what the manufacturer gave you and sometimes you are paying too much money just for the brand value alone. So you thought, well, enough of this. I'm going to build a laptop for me by myself. And you go online, uh, go Amazon and a bunch of websites and you try to order laptop parts. And what do you see that it is almost next to impossible to build your own custom laptop. And you ask yourself why and you find this video for the answer. Well, I'm here to answer your question that why you cannot build your own custom laptop. Well, one of the biggest reason is the bigger it is, the more flexibility it has. Huh. At least in the PC world. Wait a minute. Um, I have to make a call. Just Hey, um... Uh, I was uh, just making a video, you know, and uh, I I had a question in my mind. Uh, uh, can I ask you? No, you are not in speaker. Um, is my d well? Um, I can confirm you that it is true. The more bigger it is, the more flexible it is. You know what I mean. Just for an example, in an ATX case, you have more space to mount your hardware, to install more hard drives, to have a bunch of fans, custom liquid cooling, hard line tubing, or two water cooling and reservoir pumps. And if you want, you can install four quadro cards. I don't know why you need four quadros, but hey, you can. Just install it. But in the other hand, you cannot do all of this in your laptop because it will require more space and then it will be a big chunky machine. And the main goal of a laptop is portability, right? But hey, we don't want that much hardware in our system. At least give us a option to upgrade our hardware like our CPU or GPU. And we don't want to buy a new laptop in every two or three years. But why we don't have that option? Well, again, it comes to the space. Manufacturers have to design their laptops in a way that they can efficiently cool every single component in the laptop, whether it's the CPU or the GPU. And if they don't do that, we all know the consequences. What happened to Apple in the MacBooks? So. Because they have to design a cooling system efficiently, now they have to custom make their motherboards. And that is the reason why we don't have a standardized form factor in motherboards. Because they are differently designed and it varies model to model and vendor to the vendor. And to have more efficiency in cooling, most of the manufacturers are shortening your GPU and CPU to the motherboards because uh, you don't want to cook an egg with your hot laptop. You don't want, right? Not only that, a bunch of manufacturers are shortening RAM to their motherboards and limiting the upgradability to almost none. Now, why all of this is happening? Well, the biggest reason is that people want portable laptops more than they want a modular or a customizable laptop. That is one of the biggest reasons. And the more the industry going to the portability side of things, the modularity side of things is not really possible with the current technology, at least if you want a portable machine, though, as I said, because Yes, there are some machines where you can upgrade your CPU, like some gaming laptops, but come on, like, I, I never understand why people buy gaming laptops. It just totally disrupts the idea of a, la of, a lap of a laptop, like, laptop is for portability. Gaming laptops are nowhere near close to be portable, but, but, 
if you want a portable laptop with great amount of power well now you have a bunch of options from razors dell hp they make portable gaming versions of their laptop or the portable gaming laptop but hey you can always build a custom pc though and for that you have me because this channel is all about building your own pc customizing it knowing more about every single nitty gritty of every single thing and if you are down for that well don't forget to subscribe and if you like the video hit the like button if you don't leave a dislike that works for me and if you want to watch more from this channel you can check this video right here and as i said you need to subscribe and do it by here and this is Akash and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.